Nikola Tesla. I will be the greatest provider of electrical power in the world. Better than Edison. There's a contest between you. This is a battle for the brightest minds of America. Nikola Tesla was referred to as a mad scientist in his day because of the revolutionary inventions he pioneered. The foremost invention that introduced him to the world, as one who was on par with Thomas Edison, was his pioneering of the use of AC current, revolutionizing engineering physics with electricity. Behind this larger-than-life scientific figure were bizarre secrets he held close to his chest before he died but they have been publicly revealed after his death. What could they be? Did he really take his nickname of a mad scientist so seriously? Join us as we uncover Nikola's bizarre secret. Number one, the secret life of Nikola Tesla. One fact not known about Tesla is that he was highly eccentric because of his strange sleeping habits. He claimed that he never sleeps for more than two hours daily, which helped him in this creativity journey but he did admit to dozing off sometimes to recharge his battering. At one time, he worked for 84 hours without sleeping. He also has a bizarre eating habit. Tesla quit eating meat and solid meals together at one time. He only eats honey and drinks bowls of warm milk mixed with a concoction of celery and artichokes. Tesla was also known to love pigeons. In his later years, he was seen in parks feeding and relating with pigeons. He formed a peculiar bond with a white pigeon that used to pay him a daily visit. At a time, he affirmed that the pigeon loved him as much as a man loves a woman, and he loved the pigeon too, so he had a reason to live as long as he had her. Nicola can be described as a man obsessed with cleanliness. He was always seen wearing white gloves and rarely offered handshakes to people. His mother and sister are the only women with whom he is known to have had a relationship. However, he did have an unusual relationship with Anne, the daughter of the powerful industrialist Morgan. Tesla also claimed that he greatly admired Mark Twain. Another astonishing fact about Tesla is his crazy working schedule. At a time he was at work 20 hours a day, he loved formality, so when he was about to begin a significant experiment, he would dress in formal attire. He does keep his office shutters closed with the exception of thunderstorms when he enjoys watching thunder and lights like a kid. Nikola used to invite famous dignitaries to his lectures and to impress the audience with phantasmagoric electric experiments. Colorful flames lighting the room, flashes and high voltage currents passing through his body without danger and other jaw-dropping demonstrations. He had a principle never to repeat an examination in public for a second time. In 1912, Nikola Tesla was mentioned as a potential Nobel laureate when the public debate on the award recipient started. Nevertheless, he refused the chance, claiming it came too late. But he was also partly to blame for his continued disregard for his work, even to this day. He was never fond of being compared to ordinary scientists. Tesla saw himself as a discoverer who had unearthed the mysteries of nature rather than being an inventor. He said he investigated all new and potent energies capable of altering life on Earth. Nikola also refused to discuss or justify his work. He didn't even keep track of his test results, let alone publish the findings of his research. It's believed he locked up his notes, and there are allegations that a secret agent stole them after his death to look into the weird claims he was making towards the end of his life, such as a connection with other planets, death rats that could instantly disintegrate an army, and a number of other bizarre claims. Although there have been some attempts to bring Tesla to his rightful place in the spotlight, especially among scientists and inventors, he is still mostly obscure. Even now, many scientific associations decline to list his name among the trailblazers of science while other groups are being made by organizations or people to ensure that Tesla receives the credit he deserves. A few of his personal belongings are on display in a museum in Belgrade. Number two, the professional lifestyle of Nikola Tesla. Those close to Nikola Tesla knew that words like scientist, physicist, and engineer seemed inadequate to qualify his existence. Tesla, a key figure in the electricity revolution, was a certifiable classical mastermind. He was an amazing individual who claimed to be fluent in eight languages and owned a photographic brain 
that allowed him to retain an entire mass of knowledge. Tesla also stated that he saw intricate mental pictures of many of his inventions even before building prototypes, and that many of his best ideas came in a flash. No wonder he consequently neglected to create original blueprints and sketches for many of his gadgets. Tesla met two investors in 1887 who decided to support the establishment of the Tesla Electric Company. So he established a facility in Manhattan where he created the alternating current induction motor, a technological marvel that nailed down several other design's technical issues. Following Tesla's presentation of his invention at an engineering conference, the Westinghouse Company arranged for the technology to be licensed in exchange for an upfront payment and royalties based on each horsepower produced. In the late 1980s, there was a conflict known as the War of the Currents. Direct Current, DC, was pushed by Thomas Edison, who claimed that it was safer than alternating current, AC. AC was discovered by Tesla and supported by George Westinghouse because it could transport power over great distances. Westinghouse was losing money since the two, AC and DC, were undercutting each other's prices. After outlining the challenges, Westinghouse requested that Tesla sell his patents to him for a single flat sum payment. Tesla complied giving up what would have been a sizable fortune had he kept the rights Westinghouse also asked Tesla to assist with power supply for the upcoming World Columbian Exposition in Chicago in 1893, which would provide them with a huge platform to showcase the benefits of AC. Tesla amazed spectators with a range of presentations, including an electric light that didn't need any wires and helped the fair light up more light bulbs than there were in the entire city of Chicago. Subsequently, he assisted Westinghouse in obtaining a contract to produce electricity at Niagara Falls, facilitating the construction of the world's first large-scale AC power plant. This feat also doubled as a fulfillment of his childhood dreams. Number 3. Inventions of Nikola Tesla Tesla's greatest invention was the method for electrically generating and using alternating current, which was considered far more than Edison's direct current machines. Tesla's AC generator ushered in the modern technological revolution. He is known for creating the first motor to run on alternating electricity and developed the foundational technology for long-distance wireless communication. He single-handedly has almost 300 patents and claimed to have created a super weapon that would put a stop to all war on Earth. The 1891 invention of the Tesla coil had significant effects on other technologies. It was truly a revolutionary invention. It was the first system that could wirelessly transmit elections and was used in telegraphy and early radio antennas. Today, Tesla coil variants are still used in radios and televisions. Many remarkable intentions were attributed to Tesla, and his concepts are still widely discussed. Among Tesla's innovations were the enormous turbines that captured the energy of Niagara Falls, wireless telegraphy, fluorescent and neon lighting, and the channeling of alternating current, AC. Number 4 his personal lifestyle. The attractive 6-foot 2-inch Nikola Tesla was quite popular with women, though he never married, and he attributed that his single status influenced his creativity. His extreme hygiene and fear of germs possibly brought by his almost fatal illness as a youth probably prevented him from forming social bonds. He is also known for his special fears, like his fear of pearls, which made him unable to converse with any woman who wore them. Tesla believed that his best ideas come when he is in solitude. Nonetheless, he wasn't a recluse. He interacted with a number of the most well-known figures of the day during sophisticated dinner parties he threw. Mark Twain visited his laboratory frequently and supported a few of his creations. Tesla was well known for being a brilliant investor and engineer, as well as a poet, philosopher, and connoisseur. He was even featured on the cover of Time magazine and received a congratulations letter from Einstein on his 75th birthday. Tesla was viewed by the general public as a mad scientist. He said that he had created a cosmic ray-powered motor and that he was working on a non-Einsteinian physics that would give a new source of energy. He also affirmed that he had discovered a new method for taking images of thoughts and that he had created a new way that could be used for much more military applications than Nobel's weapons. Number 5. His Early Life Nikola Tesla was born in the Croatian hamlet of Smiljan into a Serbian family 
1856. He was born during what he believed to be a lightning storm. The midwife predicted he would be a child of the storm, but his mother wisely said he was a child of light. A poor connection with his parents, the death of his older brother, and a major sickness at the age of 12 clouded his boyhood. In spite of his own brilliance, one quality that won Tesla's admirers was his ability to spot talent and give credit to others. In his memoirs, he states how Mark Twain was moved to the point of tears when he informed Mark that his novels had kept him alive throughout his childhood illness. His father, Miliutin, was an Orthodox priest, while his mother, Juka Mandich, had a unique creative ability. Tesla believed he acquired his practical thinking and good memory from his mother and his theoretical and philosophical behavior from his father. As a student, his outstanding mathematical calculation skills made his teachers accuse him of cheating. After his father consented to let Nikola attend engineering school, instead of insisting he become a priest, Nikola's severe illness during his teenage years was resolved. At age 19, Tesla studied at the unit of Prague and the Technical University of Graz, Austria, hoping to become an engineer. When he witnessed the Graham Dynamo in action at Graz, he devised a method to effectively utilize alternating current. This device functioned as a generator until it was turned around to become an electric motor. He later created designs for an induction motor in Budapest, where he was able to visualize the notion of a rotating magnetic field and take the first step toward the successful use of alternating current. At college, he often clashed with his lecturers and was made fun of for not using the electric machine methods he was being taught about. The only system in use at the time was direct current and electric machines had to rotate from a constant polarity voltage using a complex commutator system, which is still in use in DC machines today. At this stage, Tesla felt there should be a more natural way to generate mechanical rotations from electricity, but he couldn't provide evidence to back up his claims. He simply believed that electric machines were handmade and unnatural in their current state because of his sharp intuition. Still, he couldn't visualize a clear way of rectifying what he thought was wrong. After gaining his degree in 1879 from the University of Graz, he worked for different businesses that improved a range of gadgets. In that period, he eventually succeeded in developing the subject of a revolving or alternating current and an electrical device that generates it. He departed for Paris before traveling to America in 1884, carrying the schematic for his new machine and some reference letters identifying him as an intelligent engineer like Edison. He also said he was given US $50,000 to address some engineering issues that Edison's company was having. Let me know your thoughts about Nikola Tesla's secret life that was hidden from the public in the comment section. Also like, share, and subscribe for more exciting videos.